Hey guys, Organized Elena, and today's video is another plan with me. We are currently planning the week of the 23rd through the 29th in my classic happy planner. As you know, I just recently switched my style to a more functional planning style, so I will show you how last week turned out. This was the first week that I did this in which I mainly used colorful boxes and icons to just kind of decorate my planner and the rest I leave it open for white space because it is more functional for me and I end up getting more done which is the point of the planner in the first place right so this week I will be doing the exact same thing I'm going to be using these colors in um, the happy planner colorful boxes um, stickers and also a bunch of sticker icons and as I go through them I will talk a little bit about what I'm using but they are from different shops this is sweet bean plans Humberg, hummingbird planner planning expired these are from my shop you can find these on organizedelena.com um, and a majority of them are from Sweet Game Plans. Some are for Sunshine Co. But I think the rest are from Sweet Bean Plans. So that's what I'm going to be using. So let's go ahead and get started. So the first thing that I'm going to be planning is my sidebar section. I'm going to be using the currently reading sticker from Sweet Bean Plans and I'll put in here what I am reading first and then I will leave space for all the things that I need to plan for the next upcoming week. Okay, so this is all of the stickers down. Um, this is basically all of the stickers that I'm going to use for next week. So let me give you a brief overview. The currently reading stickers are for what I'm reading um, regular, a regular book that I'm reading for the week, and then the uh, faith book that I'm reading for the week. So uh, with both of these, I usually do plan with these too because I do have a planner dedicated for each one of these, but I do like to keep track of what I'm reading on my sidebar here. And then I'll put in next week and all of the things that I have for the uh, upcoming week, which won't be that much for this one because next week I am going on a vacation with my husband, but I am going to keep track of some bills and some other stuff that I got um, that are coming up that I just kind of need to remind myself of. Then I have filming, which I'm currently doing now because it is Monday right now, but I just like to keep track of what I did. And then after I film this video, edit and upload, I'm going to do some designing. I'm going to finish writing my blog. Uh, some budget stuff. I didn't have a small dollar sign, so I just did this house um, to represent my budget that I need to do. This is for laundry day, which is today, so I'm going to be um, switching out laundry as I'm doing other tasks. And um, I have um, an event that I have to be to tonight, so that's what that box is for, and then trash day. And I have uh, different events which represent the colorful boxes. This is our first planner meetup, so I do like having a little icon there. I just thought that that was cute. It has nothing to do with cooking, but I thought it was cute, so I put it there. Um, this sticker is different because I had to remind myself to do something on Tuesday, and I just used this box, which this is from Erin Condren. Um, so I do have a lot of her stickers from when I was in Erin Condren, so I do like to put them in whenever I can. I am filming and designing on Wednesday morning. I have a church on Wednesday night, 
and I have some meetings and some other things to do on Friday. Saturday is laundry day, also a cleaning day and a film day. And I put a note to remind myself to pack on Sunday. Oh, and this is to remind myself to plan for Instagram in the next week. So that is the spread. So now I'm gonna go back and write everything in that I just kind of told you about. So to write everything in, I'm using the Papermate Ink Joy Gel 0.7 and let's get started. Okay, so this is my finished spread after I have written everything in. As you can see, I just kind of write little small boxes next to what I need to do. And as I do them, I'll check them off with a different color pen. More than likely, I'll be using this pink Paper Mate Ink Joy Gel pen all of next week just to check off what I've done and keep track. And as the week goes on, you know, I will fill in more, but I really like to plan like the morning of, I'll plan out the entire day. Um, so if I know the highlights of everything that I need to do, I'll write that in like I did here. And then as the day goes on, I just kind of keep track of the different things that I need to do and check them off as I go. That's why Monday has more stuff than any other day because today is Monday. So I kind of already have an idea of what I'm going to do today. So this is the final spread. I hope you like it and I hope you enjoy these functional plan with me's. I know it's not as many stickers and um, decorative stuff as you are used to, but as I said before, I am just trying to change my style. I need it to be functional for me and this is working for me. So guys, I will see you in the next uh, video. Make sure that you give this one a thumbs up and make sure you hit that subscribe button. I would love for you to be a part of our little family. Until next time, bye guys.